All right, guys, I'm going to show you a quick and easy gas calibration or verification of the E-SCO, which, you know, is probably the same process for almost all of them. Number one thing you have to remember is the module has to be plugged in for about five minutes before you try to do a gas calibration because it has a warm up period. So this one's been plugged in. It's ready to go. Let's walk through the process. OK, guys, here's the smart tank. You can see uh, you have the option of running automatic sequences, but I'm not going to do that. We're going to go into single test. And from here, we can go straight into gas calibration. And we have several options here. You see this guy here? It's ready and waiting. You see the yellow on the right hand side? That is the module. It's been recognized. We're going to click on it, click on the calibration tab. And you can see it is zeroing the module currently. So we're going to let it zero out. OK, there it goes. Now, if you have not waited five minutes, it'll tell you that you have a warm up period that you have to wait through. But it's already warmed up. So next, it's going to say feed gas. That's when we come over here and press on. It activates and it slowly bleeds off the tank into the module. Let's take a look. There it is. There's your waveform showing the gas coming in. Now it's going to register CO2, O2, N2O, and agent percentages. There, okay, there it goes. So now we can come back here and we click off. And see this little button down here that says, uh, oh, nope, this one right here, gas details. Bam, right there. Okay, so these are the values for the bottle. Now, if you remember, I said that there's an RFID badge on the bottle that has all its statistics, its mixture percentages, its dates, everything is all on the bottle. So you can see this bottle expires 9 of 23, uh, CO2 5%, yada yada. Okay, we have to configure these values right here according to what the bottle says. So CO2 5.04%. Over here, you can see CO2 is 5%. So what we gotta do is we turn this guy down. Okay, and O2 is 55% by volume. So I'm gonna go ahead and adjust that one. N2O is gonna be 33%. So I'm gonna turn this one up. and agent percentage so this module does recognize that there is an agent so you can see desfluorane is two percent by volume so i need to turn it up to two percent let's do a second check co25 o255 n2o 33 agent two percent and accept calibration okay and it updates the date right here. So guys, that is the Smart Tank quick and easy gas calibration. Very easy. And I love the fact that it has the bottle details on the tag. And all you got to do is press one little button and it reads the values off to you. And all you got to do is make sure that those values register those values and you're all set. Thanks for watching, guys.